I'm all about that bump, about that bump. Welcome back to All About That Bump. We are in week 29 this week and I'm actually a week ahead of the updates, which means I am 30 weeks pregnant right now and I am starting to feel it, let me tell you. I enjoy the last stretch of pregnancy, you know, the last 10 weeks. I like it because I'm not as nauseous. I would rather take being huge and feeling, you know, crampy and all that. I'd rather take that over being nauseous any day of the week. This week I haven't had as much crying However, I have just felt so down on myself and the way that I look. And I think that that's a normal thing in pregnancy because I remember feeling like that with Eden too. But you just don't really feel attractive. No matter what you put on, no matter what you do with your hair, no matter what you do with your makeup, you just look in the mirror and you're like, really? I like having a belly. I like showing off my belly. And I do on my Instagram photos all the time. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you know. But that doesn't mean that I necessarily feel beautiful. And I think I may end up doing a video on this because it's just something that I felt is on my heart lately and I'm sure that there's so many other pregnant women out there that are dealing with the same kind of emotions and feelings. And I know that I'm not alone and I know you guys aren't alone. I might make a video about it, I don't know. Even when David's like, you look beautiful or you look so pretty or whatever, I just have a hard time believing him because I'm like, Really? I'm fat, I'm huge, and I feel like crap. The crazy thing is though, no matter how many pictures I take of myself, I do not look as big in the pictures as I feel like I look in person. Does that make sense? I'll just be like, step, step, step. Oh, this will show off how big I am. And then I'll look at the picture and I'll be like, I don't look big at all. I just felt really huge. Like I feel it in my bones and my body. And I photographed a wedding this weekend, um, an all day wedding and I actually did better than I thought I was gonna do and it didn't even hurt that badly. I think it was because I wasn't really focusing on it, I was just focusing on the wedding itself. But it definitely made me tired for the rest of the weekend, like for the next few days. I just kind of sat around and was completely lazy and that was perfectly okay with me because I felt like I just needed that time to recover. I have scheduled my maternity photos. Those are gonna be taking place next month and I'm excited about those. Also a newborn photographer. It took me forever, you guys, to find someone that was under like $600. But because of a friend of mine, I was able to get the hookup and I found someone for a really good deal. And so I am very, very excited for that because newborn photography is so important to me and I'm sure a lot of you that are watching this is important to you too. That's the one thing that I really am glad I did with Eden is right after she's born, 10 days after we did newborn photos and I look at those photos all the time. So I think it's definitely important. I was finally able to capture his movement and I put that on Instagram as well. So if you guys wanna go see that video, go check it out. Like I said, I feel huge, but I'm really not that big. I do feel like I get lower every day though. Thank you guys so much for watching. In the comments below, tell me what your favorite thing is about the final stretch of pregnancy. And we will see you in our next update. Bye.